Hello, just wanted to show you what I've got this week. This is a 2020 Kia Telluride. And this version is outfitted with a roof nest, Sparrow rooftop tent. You've probably seen these on cars, trucks, SUVs around town. They look like big, big, I guess you would say cargo boxes. But inside is a pop-up tent, which I'm going to demonstrate. This one again is from Roof Nest. It's the Sparrow. It's new for 2020. And it's a, they call it a two-person tent. You could go too comfortably, maybe even fit, definitely a, you know, you could fit a dog up there with you, a small child. Uh, this is a reinforced ABS. This is what you would call a, a hard top, hard sided rooftop tent, unlike some of the soft sided ones you see around. Um, on top, you don't really want to put much cargo up there, but you could put solar panels. Um, quick walk around here. We've got the latches on the side, on the back, and on the front here. And all you have to do is unclip those, and there's hydraulics on each corner, and it pops it up. Right now, it's sitting on uh, this Thule rack, which goes right into the rails of the, the Kia. Um, hopefully, if your SUV has a roof rack already, it can attach to that. The tent itself is 130 pounds, and pretty aerodynamic looking, as you can see. But I'm gonna do give it a quick, I'm gonna pop it up here, let you check it out. So first I'm just gonna, you can see the, actually the latch here. So you push in this kind of holding release, release that. That up. I'm gonna do this with one hand here, which might be a little tricky. It's definitely easier to operate this with two people, but one person is definitely doable, especially when you're putting it up. So this is just a uh, easy buckle. This one. The last one, and it's kind of held down right now because of the hydraulics are are uh, pressed in. But it's all looks like it's released. I'm gonna give it a little shove here. goes. It's a Roof Nest Sparrow and again it uh, just pops up on its own so that took what uh, less than two minutes so instead of having to roll into a campsite mess with putting up a tent poles and crawling down into a tent putting all of your bedding in all of that this is ready to go in under two minutes. Let me show you inside. This is a telescoping ladder that comes with it. This can actually be stored in the tent so it doesn't take up space in your vehicle. So I just extended it here and you've got what they call it, these holders, latches on here. Put on there. You also can access the tent from the either side or the back of the tent. So if you fit a Jeep or something like that where you wanted to um, go through the back. These windows also a double as doors on the sides in the back. Let's take a look. I already opened this up. And here I've got some Blankets, sleeping bags already popped in. Kids were in here having fun. Kids love these. They've got their remnants of uh, string cheese. But there's a window right there that, again, um, what's nice actually about this is you don't have to put up a rain fly. Some of the other the soft-sided tents, there's a rain fly to keep warmer, to keep water out. This one, it just has this uh, canvas outside window that you just you know zip up and that's it. The top is quilted pattern here super durable roof nest comes with this cargo basket up there you put clothing in there uh, extra bedding other pillows and because this kind of this pop-up is uh, is a little raised here 
Um, you could put pillows in here and, and do storage so you can keep that outside of your vehicle and have more room. But as you can see, this is really, really spacious in here. There are the kind of hydraulic arms that keep it up. And this isn't gonna collapse at all unless you really give it a tug. So there's no worries about that. And there's nothing really to lock in place. It kind of does that on its own. Oh, can't forget the mattress. It's a really nice thick foam here. It's like a nice great futon. Better than anything that you would ever kind of carry with you to transport for camping. So you're really real comfortable in this. And again, from this view up here, and you can see here, I've got a great view up top. Super comfortable, great cross breezes, much cooler than a regular tent. Away from all the critters on the ground. If it's wet on the ground or if it's rocky, no worries about that. The one thing with the rooftop tent, like with any, any tent, you'd want to make sure your vehicle is as level as possible. That's about it. These straps on the front here and the back are for pulling the tent down when you're collapsing it, which I can give a quick demonstration as well. Uh, in the back here with the Telluride, it's funny, there's no bumper, so I bring a step stool. But to pull it down, essentially pull down on these, and you can see how it goes down. I'll grab that corner, I'll clasp it there, I'll need both hands to do that. So I'll save that for another video. I just want to show you, this is the Roof Nest Sparrow. It's new for 2020. This is kind of their most popular tent. It retails again for $28.95, $2,895. And it's available now. Go to roofnest.com and check it out.